The COVID-19 crisis continues to be unforgiving and unrelenting in most parts of the world. Humanitarian and development sectors have been heavily affected. UN agencies like IOM had to quickly adapt and overcome new challenges in order to allow for the continuation of life-saving work. In Turkey, IOM runs one of the largest humanitarian operations in the world, providing aid in response to the Syrian conflict. Now in its ninth year, the Syrian conflict continues to actively displace innocent civilians. It's causing widespread human suffering. Uh, and over 11 million people are in need of assistance today. In northwest Syria alone, uh, out of a population of 4 million people, uh, over 2.7 million people are, in, are displaced and in need of humanitarian assistance. Uh, that is over 65% of the, the population there. Last year, through our humanitarian pipeline and our other multi-sector programming, uh, we assisted over 850,000 people. Uh, in the first three months of this year, we assisted over 450,000 people. Uh, which is more than half of the previous year. Uh, this is unfortunately owing to the increase in hostilities and the, the large-scale displacement that we've been seeing. Uh, given the immense and, and critical humanitarian needs, you know, we recognize that any interruption of our humanitarian pipeline, of our multi-sector programming, uh, would have quite disastrous consequences. Uh, so in light of COVID-19 and other challenges that we've, we've faced, um, we've taken all necessary precautions and measures so that we can continue our, our humanitarian assistance uh, without interruption while still maintaining the, the, uh, the safety and security of our staff and our other uh, employees. And we particularly focused on our warehouse and the transshipment hubs. The center of IOM's response is here, at the Borch Warehouse in the southeastern city of Gaziantep. Established in 2014, it spans 15,300 square meters and employs 100 staff. The warehouse serves as a lifeline for aid going to Syrians and other displaced persons in Turkey and northwest Syria. The Birch Warehouse carries a diverse range of stock, which is necessary in emergency settings, such as tents, blankets, mattresses, and jerry cans. In addition to normal warehouse activities, such as receiving storage and dispatch, the warehouse also conducts other activities such as quality control, a kitting process where we tailor our kits to the uh, specific needs of the beneficiaries, and we conduct trainings and workshops on best practices. To ensure warehouse operations continued unhindered and without delays, adjustments to the workplace were made quickly. This has helped ensure the safety and security of staff while maintaining the same level of efficiency reached prior to the onset of the COVID pandemic. In order to keep up with operational demands in light of COVID-19, the warehouse implemented specific mitigating measures, such as educating all staff on the dangers and prevention measures for COVID-19, adjusting our operational protocol to ensure that social distancing measures are taken, providing personal protective equipment to all staff, and monitoring all the entries and exits into the premise to ensure that the space is quarantined. In just the first quarter of 2020, IOM dispatched over 620 trucks of aid to displaced persons in Idlib and northern Aleppo. The warehouse on average receives and dispatches roughly 220 ton trucks per month. The goods received are tracked using IOM's internal portal system, which allows us to know exactly the quantity of stock that we have at any given time. For outgoing stock, we implement a commodity tracking system, which enables us to track the item from the moment it leaves the warehouse until it reaches the beneficiary. The warehouse employs roughly 100 people, uh, which consists of administration, storekeepers, whose responsibilities are to receive, store, and dispatch the stock, uh, our quality control technicians, as well as our maintenance staff that maintain the equipment, as well as the, the premise. Together, 
these critical IOM staff, along with you and partners, prevent conflict-affected communities from being left behind at a time when much of the world's attention has been diverted. The humanitarian aid flowing out of this warehouse is ensuring the survival of hundreds of thousands of vulnerable migrants and refugees, and is keeping hope alive.